Welcome back to Den's Viking Adventures. We're back in Millbrook. We're right on the fat bike. A little bit of snow on the ground actually this time. It's minus three right now. Over the next few days, temperature's supposed to be climbing. It's uh, Friday before Christmas. Anyway, so I figure I'd get out of here while I don't know how soggy of a mess it's gonna get. It's been a couple weeks since I've been out. I've gained some some weight from eating. I haven't been using my biking muscles as much, so we'll see how this goes today. Might be a little bit of a hike a bike. Amazing how beautiful it is in here. There's snow on the ground. So right now we're heading along the old rail trail. It's been uh, definitely packed by a lot of hikers, some bikers. Some fat bikes, some regular uh, mountain bikes. As many of you know, our dog Jersey has passed away a week and a half, almost two weeks ago. I'm gonna miss her. There are some videos with her, but the mouse she actually came out of that, that's not on the videos, it's quite a bit more. Each of us family members, she always did a lot with us all. She went to work every day. And whenever we could take her, wherever we're going in the evenings, we take her. So she's gonna be missed. We're gonna try out Millie. Millie Vin. Vanilli trail here.
a little shaky on that skinny, but I did it. Ouch! That didn't sound good. Better. Please, drifter. I forgot to wear my neck warmer, which also covers my face. Because the last thing I need to do is get bronchitis and pneumonia right now. But, so we're just gonna have to take it a little slower, take it easy, avoid gasping for air like it's the last thing. I yeah, like a last thing I need have to do. So just have a bit of fun here. just going on here probably let some air out of the tires some underlying ice
I will say, when you're riding with a fat bike, everything sure is, is a, it's a little slower, at least for me, you know. I haven't weighed this bike, but, oh, I almost placed bats so between five to 10 pounds heavier than my Norco fluid. at the top of High Plains Drifter. Just heading up to the, the top of 
the itch and uh, <sighs> trench down and then we'll go around do the loop and then go back up to the top head down trench down I think after that I just I don't want to take on too much more I didn't bring any lights with me I don't want to be stuck in the dark with no light Right now you don't really need studs in your tires, but I think my tires have studs and it just eliminates any concern if, if there is any ice that I might slip or reduces the concern. Here we are going down the around the itch. A little less snow on this. It gets uh, it gets more sunlight than that, so it melts off a little quicker this section does it's all edge of the field also opening for lights Now we're getting a little more snow and ice covered here now. But still lots of openings in these trees, so. What a beautiful day. Sun's starting to get low, so yeah. I'll uh, head down trench. Here's trench down here.
Beautiful. Beautiful. You start to get a bit of snow packed in these rocks. It makes a difference in how you travel them. And also being a wider tire places you would have stuck your skinny tire in don't necessarily fit the fat bike. Fat tight bike. Uh, fat bike tire. Wow. New tongue. Bought it yesterday. bunch of rattling going on over here yeah definitely next time I come out check my diaper tire pressures that's some freaking air out of them Oh my god. Oh. Oh. I just bagged myself with my bike. Oh. That's enough to almost make you want to puke. Whew. Wow. So I did. Not into doing jumps today, but I will do the rollables. Definitely. Right 
hurts the hands uh, not having the suspension on the front fork, having carpal tunnel. I will say the hands do not like me right now. Yeah, I think uh, the day after Christmas or whatever, we're back into double digits. Complete insanity for Chris for December. Uh, stays this warm. January and February could be loaded full of snow. Now we're gonna head back down. We're gonna head out, I think. I've only done one other biking session once within four weeks, so this is two within two in a month. It's not enough, and I've gained weight, so you know, falling apart. I feel like, but you know, I'll get back into it. We're gonna hit Millie Vanilli once more here, just for shits and giggles, and then we'll head straight on out. So as we're heading out here, I think uh, next time I come, I think I'm gonna might park over at Elgar Drive parking lot. It's a uh, bit of a climb right off the bat to uh, get out, to get up to the trails. But then you got a bit of downhill before you come back up and stuff like that. So I don't know, just different routes to play with, but if you want to see more videos like this, please like and subscribe. Helps the channel. Spread the word. And uh, everyone, wish everyone a happy holiday. Uh, enjoy your family time. If you can, get out, get riding, have some fun. If there's still snow around, do some tobogganing. But main thing is have fun with family. So we'll talk to you. Talk to you soon and thanks for watching again.